What's up everybody? It has been a minute since I've made a video. Just had a lot going on with work and then stuff going on uh, with the holidays. Uh, but I did get two Team U packages in uh, to use some props for my action figures I wanted to share. And then I got a little bit of a Cyber Monday haul. Uh, I was real happy with this year's Cyber Monday. And uh, I never really pick up anything on Black Friday, but I always get pretty lucky on Cyber Monday. But uh, let's take a look at the props first, then in a separate video will be the uh, little haul video. But um, I, as you can see right here, I've got, uh, I believe his name is Agent Wu, uh, testing out one of the chairs. But in the background, you'll see right there, those are two bookcases that I've put together. Uh, you've seen one of them, <clears throat> excuse me, in a previous video. And... Um, they were very well made. Uh, just to give you an idea again, in case you didn't see the first video, um, I want to say it's $7 for this um, with uh, on their app. And uh, here's a figure right here to kind of give you an idea of how it scales. So right there, uh, pretty nice little bookcase to have with your figures in the background. Other thing I picked up right here is another like bathroom uh, sink. Uh, I did have to glue the two gold uh, knobs in. They come in a separate little Ziploc along with it. It opens up um, all the cabinet spaces. So uh, definitely work well with your action figures. Again, let's see, right there. Give you an idea of what the size is can't remember the cost of all these things I grab. Uh, some of them are like free gifts sometimes, but um, it's a nice little bathroom sink for your action figures. Uh, got two um, stationary type like chairs. Uh, they each came with like a pillow. The pillow is a little too much. So if you're trying to put a figure in it with the pillow, you're not gonna have much room to work with. You can see I have a figure sitting in it. I'll show a comparison of what it looks like with the figure standing next to it. It's like a cloth material. It's wooden um, legs on it. I think that's wood. That's wood. That's wood with a cloth overlay. Uh, it's got a cushion. That's what it looks like with a figure next to it. This is what it looks like with a figure sitting in it. You can see is uh, buttocks does rest on the chair uh, so it scales real well and uh, yeah looks pretty good the next thing we got is this toilet I got a couple of these uh, coming in I like the way it's scaled if you ever do like a bathroom scene where um, someone might be fighting in the bathroom of a public restroom or something but uh scales real well got a working seat working lid um nothing on the bottom um it's a little hollow right here so it can get a little heavy but of course that'd be kind of against a wall somewhere but yeah scales pretty well so in case you want to use it for your photography next thing i got was this water dispenser I can't remember if I've had this one before or another one that was a little bit smaller. And this one still is too small, but uh, at least it's better than the other one they make, which is about like that. So it's kind of a little bit more bigger. I don't know if that's a switch or... I can't tell if that is a switch in the back. Um, this stuff is all mass produced in China and uh, you get it at a pretty good... Uh, cost um right here is a, a stand-up mic the mic does come free so if you want the figure holding the mic but um i figured this would be good again for action figure photography standing right there and then the next thing we got these two are the same thing i think i've showed one of these off before so you got that color and that color and it's just like a, I guess it could be a vending machine where it's got some cold items in it. Or uh, if you're building an office diorama, you could put some stuff in it. Um, but it's real well made. 
It's got, uh, it's made of wood. Shelves do come in and out with a piece of plastic. There's a piece of plastic on the lid right there or the door. And uh, I think I got another color. I can't remember if it was on a previous video. But you could utilize these in office picks, uh, convenience store picks, or maybe even uh, if you're building like a collection room for your action figure. Uh, laboratory to keep specimens in. But um, yeah. These are pretty well made, and, and like I said, these aren't very expensive. It just depends on what you're looking at. Again, pay attention to the description. I've kind of ordered stuff that I expected, and then it came in, and it was definitely not what I expected. And uh, that's about it. Next video is going to be my Cyber Monday haul. As you can see, i got some stuff in the background. Hope you enjoyed this vid. I hope you enjoyed these props. Let me know in the comments which one was your favorite. Let me know if these videos are helping you on uh finding stuff this is like online dollar tree it's i mean it's just perfect if you're looking for just inexpensive props for your action figures without having to drive store to store the shipments do take a while because again they do come directly from china and uh averages about 10 to 11 days to get it once you submit your order and uh yeah it's just kind of fun place to find some stuff so I um, hope you enjoyed that and uh, hope you're having a good holiday season. All right, later. Bye.